Okay, so spoiler alert. This isn't the only Turtles game to feature in this top five. And why, you may ask? Well, for me, the first Turtles game is iconic. It was one of the first arcade games by Konami to feature four players, which meant that you and your three pals could team up as Leonardo, Michelangelo, Donatello and Raphael to take on the evil Shredder as you try to save a news reporter, April O'Neil. The animation, stage design and music were spot on, and if you could finish this game without dipping into next month's pocket money, let me know in the comments below. Much like the Turtles in the early 90s, The Simpsons had become a household name with every 10 year old wanting to be Bart Simpson. And the arcade game wasn't bad at all either. Again, boasting a massive 4 player arcade cabinet by Konami, you could play as Homer, Marge, Bart and Lisa as you battle your way through Springfield trying to save Maggie, who at the start gets caught up in Mr Burns and Smithers' diamond heist. The game featured some excellent sound effects and music that felt like they'd been ripped from the 90s cartoon. The gameplay was fantastic and that's what puts it at my number four. Blow up your balloon and go after Maggie. Ready? Go! Coming in at number 3, and the first entry for Capcom in this list, is Final Fight. For me, Final Fight set the standard of all retro side-scrolling beat-em-ups to come. The character sprites were huge, the moves were great, the gameplay was fantastic. In this game, the mayor of Metro City's daughter gets kidnapped, and you and your pals Cody and Guy go along for the ride as we punch, smash, pick up drain pipes, smash them over the head, and battle our way through Metro City to save the damsel in distress. And it even spawned the way for a lot of the characters to make it into the later Street Fighter series. For me, this is my number three. Coming in at number 2, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Turtles in Time, and as I explained earlier, the second turtle game in this list. Now for a lot of people they will probably put this game at number 1. It is such a well polished game. Again, another Konami 4 player cabinet, the game was fantastic. It took everything what made the original so good and amped it up by 100%. The sound effects were absolutely spot on, the stage design was fantastic. This is why Turtles in Time hits number 2 spot for me. And now, some honourable mentions.
And what is this you may be saying? Alien vs Predator isn't number one? Yep, that's right. For me, it got a little repetitive, killing the same aliens over and over again. While it was a great game, this leads me directly into my number one. For me, The Punisher takes top spot. And who doesn't love a hero vigilante like Frank Castle? The Punisher, for me, has everything in a side-scrolling beat-em-up. The animation, the colours, the sound effects, the gameplay, and even better still, two-player mode, you even get to get joined by Nick Fury. The moves were great for each character, the enemy variation was fantastic, and in this game, we battle through the city streets to take out Kingpin and his henchmen. It was the game out of all the others in this list that I had the most fun playing it and I always went back to in the arcade. So guys, that is my top 5 retro side-scrolling beat-em-ups that I think you guys need to play. Please leave me a comment down below and let me know what your list, or even if it's the same list, just a different order, and what that would be. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed this and want to see more retro stuff coming, hit the subscribe to get notified when all future videos go live. Thanks very much for all the support. Stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one.